Hello boys and welcome to this video for the production and the next part of Creative So, uh, since the last time I recorded, there actually have been added new villager roles. You, there were new villager roles though, I don't know where to look for them because that information has not yet been added. But the new uh, villager roles is blacksmith, outfitter, toolmaker and explosive as an expert. So that's gonna be uh, really interesting. I have no idea where to look for them, and it's daytime, so that won't uh, help me. If it's daytime, I can't really uh, do, go and look for where I could find them. There is uh, it's better to go out during nighttime. But I do believe that means we should uh, first of all just uh, put the way. A lot of stuff we have on us. We don't need all this stuff on us. That's a chest. I can put that out and put more stuff in that. We technically don't need anything with us besides uh, some a few blocks. Let's just uh, see what this village has to get. Grab what this village has to give us first. All right. So, food goes in here. Mob drop goes in here. She really held out on us and gives things for leafies. Let's put the wood stuff in here. Fans goes in here, and the last two ones, I uh, have to put them randomly somewhere. Alright, let's uh, grab a stack of stone, and let's sleep until it's night time. Alright, so now it's night time, so let's go and explore and see if we can find any of these new villagers. I'm gonna fly this way because uh, it seems more bountiful than the other directions. Might be a little longer wait until I get to land, but shouldn't take too long. Maybe I should do a stream on the server where I uncover the whole map. Oh, I know something we actually should do. We should always bring a bed with us. So what is the request to craft a bed? That rock door. Huh. Yeah, we, it will take a little bit of time. So I suppose uh, when it becomes daytime, we teleport back and we craft a bed and we bring that with us uh, for the next uh, roundabout. But I'm probably gonna do mostly today just exploring, see if we can find the new villagers and so on and so on. I mean, we still haven't found the minor villager. I do want to find the miner villagers because uh, he would give me so good stuff. And considering they have added more villagers now, I do need to make a villager hall. I 
Danke sehr, Kipa. Kipa, 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 Kipa. Kipa! Ha! I think I saw a villager. Yeah, it's a villager. It's a chef, though, but... I don't need to complain. Yes, chef. One village upgrade and one be uh, programmable villager. The programmable villager is what I want. <sighs> well, we know this area ain't very useful then for... Wait. Head in the wrong direction. We are supposed to go west. I think uh, maybe uh, one of the new villages would maybe spawn in canyon. Would make sense. I don't see anything else than a chest. There's a chest up there? Uh, no. These butterflies are disorienting. You're never sure if they're truthful or lying to you. Wait, they have no reason to head north. What a nice surprise, I went to Wonderland, exactly what I don't want. So we could head a little bit north, just on cover area. I'll just head straight west. That's a snowy canyon. I think it must be. I think the safest place kind of <coughs> to live on credit inverse if you just want to avoid people is a snowy area. A snow canyon ideal. Unless you want to live on a uh, lava like that is. Huh. Found a present. Santa Santa has been around. I 
Let's see. Anything? There's some normal canyon. I think the village actually can be found during daytime too. But they're much more rare than chests are. And chests are a good source of loot. I don't know any villagers to spawn on grassland. We need to find the four new villagers. And we need to make a villager hall. And a barn right next to it. That's it, um. gonna make a bed I think we need some metal wax or certainly it would yeah. metal wax stone wood some shredded leaves. I do believe I should have some laying around somewhere. Yeah, shredded leaves. And the most... I don't want to craft anything new to make this, so I just grab the blue pigments and craft the blue bed instead of going around looking for stuff. Well, I want to put up the bed. The programmable village I'm going to put there. Oops, not stone. Alright, let's sleep. I think I'm gonna head east this time though. Of course. Of course, something that should not have been able to block me was able to block me.
Frozen oceans usually always hold a lot of frozen news. I think very well uh, that uh, very well at adapting to uh, each environment. Okay, they also uh, yield the uh, normal things. I think there were these you are supposed to uh, kill around Christmas time. Not the wrong. I think the chef is the one that's more easiest to find. I'm saying there's a keeper this way. I don't think I have a lot of problem with the baby leaf is uh because I am stronger armed now. Doesn't matter what village we find, we uh, help them or no matter what. And uh, because we get programmable villages, and they are useful either way. I think we have actually a chance of finding uh, villager classes in chests. We find an elf fee. I'm gonna check that because they might actually sell the villager classes. Let me know. Hey, little guy. Back here, little son of a bitch. Hey, what's the silver keep? I think. It's uh, incredibly hard to trap keepers to try to tame them. Uh, there are so you. There are no way to tame a keeper without actually trapping them somehow. I mean, I had my uh, event. Uh, uh, hall uh, where I caught a lot of keepers in But I do think we might actually have run out of time That's why I'm building a pillar so I don't have to stand on the ground while I end this episode because we're gonna keep exploring in the next one and the next one and the next one and that's probably all I'm gonna do But Eddie, that was all I have for creative words. It's on the I'll see you next time. Bye bye